Hey, Sanji, have you seen my laptop? Frank has it. What is he doing with it? He's investing in the stock market. Seems like everybody's been doing that ever since this thing with GameStop happened. What research has he done? He read a tweet by Elon Musk. Nope, I'm pulling the plug. Frank, you can't just go and invest into the stock market without knowing the risks of what you're doing. <laughs> I'm short stocking. Frank, do you even know what that means? All right, well, you clearly know what you're doing, Mr. Wolf of Wall Street. Maybe when I come back, you'll have made enough money to buy your own computer. <gasps> Bye, low. Mm. No, 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 how did this happen? Oh no, oh, oh, oh my progress. What is it now? I lost $10,000. Well, I hate to say it, but that's kind of what happens when you jump on the bandwagon. When you don't know what you're doing, you leave it up to the masses to decide it for you, only to find out that you might end up running a little short. That's the problem with jumping on impulse. If you had taken the time to actually study and figure out how stocks work, you might have been able to prevent all of this. But one thing concerns me, and that's how did you get the money to invest in the first place? Your debit card? Nami <laughs> Swa! <sighs> well, you know, you win some, you lose some, Philip. That's how life works. Hey, did I ever tell you that I invested a ton of Grant's life savings into BitConnect a couple years back? <laughs> I bet that that's probably doing really well. I haven't checked it in a while, so it's probably accumulated a lot of... <sighs> let's keep this one between you and me and let's not tell Grant, okay? What?